Wondering how a guy will behave when he's interested in you versus just being polite with you? Curious to learn the subconscious cues he'll give you when he's being more than just a nice guy? I've got those 10 signs he'll give you coming up right now. Hey everyone, I'm dating and relationship coach Ryan Patrick. Today, I wanna to further expand upon a very popular video I did about a year and a half ago to arm you with even more tools if you're asking yourself, does he like me or is he just being nice? So just to be clear, this isn't a rehashing of the signs I gave you in part one, but rather in addition to them. And I think you'll find these signs are even more intriguing and nuanced. But first, if you're new to my channel and you prefer to get your dating tips from a fun-loving guy who who keeps his videos entertaining while giving you no BS actionable advice, just click subscribe below and make sure to turn on all notifications so you can get a friendly reminder to join our community on Mondays when my new videos come out. Thank you so much for joining us. Oh, and be sure to hit that like button. Also, if you have a specific question or need immediate advice from me regarding a guy or current situation, just make sure to visit my Wizio page at daterboy.com slash Wizio and tell me a little bit about what's going on. I'll then send you back a four to seven minute video response that's specifically tailored to your situation. The reviews have been absolutely phenomenal, so a special thanks to all of you that have already checked out this very convenient service. I'll be over on Wizio if you need me. Now, let's dig into those 10 signs he likes you and how that's different than him just being polite with you. Let's be clear, there are different types of men out there that express interest differently, but they all fall into similar sequences and patterns of behavior. Now, I've made sure to leave out any ambiguous signs of interest. I've also left out any predominant behaviors that narcissists tend to use, or any guys that are just trying to manipulate you. But just understand, nothing is absolute. We wanna see at least three or four of these behaviors cluster together to feel confident that he's actually interested. So just keep that in mind. Here are 10 signs he's into you versus just being nice to you. The first sign is he'll mirror your body language. I'm actually pretty surprised I didn't cover this sign in part one of this series, so I figured I would open with this one today. When you notice a man beginning to copy your body movements as you're speaking with him, it means he's subconsciously becoming more comfortable with you. One simple way you can test this with him is just to lay your head on your hand like this for a few minutes to see if he ends up doing the same thing. A guy who's just being nice to you will never mirror your body language. The second sign is he'll pretend he can't hear you. What's that? Sorry, I, I can't hear you. There, that's better. What were you saying? If a guy likes you, he's naturally gonna wanna be closer to you. So he'll lean in and use his bad hearing as an excuse. Take this one with a grain of salt though. If you're at a really loud party or social gathering, he may really not be able to hear what you're saying. A guy who's just being nice to you will lean back and respect your space, keeping a moderate distance from you. The third sign is he'll minimize any surrounding distractions. A guy who digs you is not gonna allow anything to get in the way of his interaction with you, like his cell phone or loud conversations that are nearby. He'll at least make an attempt to get you to a quieter place where he can focus on you 100%. A guy who's just being nice to you won't mind checking his cell phone while talking to you. He may even use distractions as an excuse to peel away from you. Oh, what was that? Excuse me. The fourth sign is he'll ask questions that build on each other. Now, when I talk about him asking you questions, I am not talking about business or career related questions where he's trying to get to know you professionally. I'm talking about him asking you about your interests, your family, and your life aspirations, that kind of thing. A guy who's just being nice to you will keep his questions short and business related. So you like your job? Tell me about it. The fifth sign is he'll recall unimportant things you told him. Oh, didn't you say you wash your hair on Thursdays because Wednesdays you watch Riverdale and bake cakes with your mom? Right? If he recalls minor details you blurted out about your life, you better believe he likes you and he's listening to you. A guy who's just being nice to you will only remember details about you that most likely benefit him in some way. The sixth sign is he'll dig for common interests you share. Do you like cherries? Okay, no. Do you like bearded dragons or any similar type of reptile? Not so much. Do you like Cheetos? Really? Me too! 
If he's fishing for common things you two like, he's trying to find a good reason to talk to you longer. A guy who's just being nice to you won't make any attempts at making these common interest connections with you. The seventh sign is he'll have trouble ending the interaction. Well, I guess I should go. But if you want, I could fix your taillight for you right now because it's out. I just noticed when he pulled up. If this guy likes you, he's gonna be stuck to you like glue and he's gonna have an incredibly hard time peeling away from you each time. A guy who's just being nice to you will just say, Good, I can go now? Okay, bye. The eighth sign is he'll find reasons to see you. Well, look, I could just explain it over the phone to you. Boring. Or I could just come over and... Well, it is easy, yes. You just unplug it to reset it is all. When guys like you, they want to be helpful, even if they know you probably got it. So if he's searching for reasons to see you, it's a huge sign of interest. A guy who's just being nice to you will only see you if he has to in social situations. The ninth sign is he'll constantly be escalating the interaction. Hey, you mind if I call you sometime? Hey, good to see you. Want to hang out Thursday night? Hey, you want to meet my parents at a barbecue they're hosting? If he likes you, he will always be moving to the next micro step of commitment with you. And at times, it may even seem a little too fast. A guy who's just being nice to you will always keep your level of interaction in the same gear. Yep, I'll see you at work. The tenth sign is he'll have his game face on. If you ever catch a guy talking to himself, fidgeting with his clothes, or just looks like he's on a mission to complete an important task while you're talking to him, he likes you. He most likely at this point has so many different things going on in his head and is trying to prevent himself from making a mistake in front of you. A guy who's just being nice to you won't really care how he acts or comes across in front of you, ever. So now I want to hear from you. What is something a man has done in front of you that still leaves you wondering if he liked you or not? Let me know down in comments below. This video, I will do my best to get back to every one of you. Also, if you need some immediate advice from me, just hit me up at daterboy.com slash wizio and I'll put together a four to seven minute video response in as little as two days. If you found this video entertaining and helpful, please give it a like below. Got some great online dating content starting to come to you next week. So until then, thanks for stopping by.